A story we brought you Friday has connected a little boy with a trombone. A fire destroyed that Spartanburg family's home. 7 News' Alessandra Young explains how this gift came at just the right time. This house behind me holds many memories for the family who once lived here. Amongst the items destroyed in a fire was an 11 year old boy's trombone just a week before his concert. But he got one just in time, thanks to one of our 7 News viewers' acts of kindness. A trombone is a trombone, and I'm glad that I'm still alive to play a trombone. Knox Sims Harris lost his home and everything inside to a fire last Friday. He says he was bringing his trombone home to practice before his big concert. I've been practicing music a lot lately. Um, like, I normally don't bring it home, but this is my first concert, so I want to make sure I'm not messing up. The intense heat from the fire melted the trombone. His family wasn't sure if he would be able to play in the concert. But thanks to Contessa Miller, Knox's music career will carry on. They have just a huge plate full of problems right now. And this was kind of a preeminent one because of the upcoming, upcoming concert. So it was nice to be able to put that in their hands today. Miller says the trombone was her son's when he was in middle school. She says the instrument has a long history. Not long after I got it, I was involved in a car crash. The trombone was in the trunk. The trunk was completely folded over the trombone. Thankfully, they were able to salvage the trombone and years later pass it to a new owner. Miss Miller, I very much appreciate you and I thank you for letting me use the trombone. Descendi Sims is Knox's grandmother and owned the house he was living in. She says this selfless act has put some light in their life during a time of darkness. I'm so grateful to her because she wanted to make sure my grandson had everything for that concert, and she did just that. The family wants to thank everyone that stepped in to help, especially Contessa Miller, who gave Knox not only a trombone, but another chance at making music. And that is how you put together a trombone. The Millers are also planning on going to his concert on December 2nd in Spartanburg. Alessandra Young, 7 News. It's not just the instrument. The, the Millers also got an outfit for Knox to wear when he performs at his concert.